Oh, Darce Defense. We can go over Darce Defense for sure. There's a really easy Darce technique I know. All right, so let's go into some Darce. Uh, one, one quick Darce Defense. You, normally, you don't have to deal with Darces in the Gi, but since we're here and it's a question for the, from the Legion members, we'll, uh, we'll get to that. So this is going to be kind of tricky to do, but I'm going to try and pull it off. Let's refix my Gi real fast here. So this is a technique that Leo Vieira invented, and I learned it probably eight or nine years ago, and it's served me really well. There's all these kind of weird moves that no one knows and no one really does, but they're out there and they work. So Miha gets me in a Dars, uh, let's, this, like this. So here, you're in the thread of the Dars. Normally, he's going to start with this grip here. He's going to use that to push my elbow, my head down with his elbow so he can get the angle to then secure the grip over the shoulder here like this. Can you guys hear that? Okay. I'll try and clip this on my sleeve, maybe. So from this position here, my goal is to open my shoulder, right? Actually, I have to put it on this one. My goal is to open my shoulder. So let's rotate this way so they can see this a little better. So I'm here, put your put your legs over here more. Yeah, so look, I'm gonna be getting darsed in this position. I wanna roll to the side uh, that I'm getting choked on. So if he's choking this side, I wanna be here with my arm up. And now from this position, I need to create as much space as possible between my shoulder and my neck. This side is where I'm getting choked, but the only side I can control is on this side because my arm is on this side. So I'm gonna use this arm to create space so my neck is open here. And with my neck being open, I can actually survive the darts a little bit longer. Now look, I'm gonna reach up and over my leg, but I post my foot on the mat in a way that it supports it. So if he tries to drive my elbow down to get the darts tighter, my leg supports this and can defend the, mo the motion. Now watch this. This is just to hold out for a second. I bring this hand through to his knee, like so, and I bring my other leg underneath and I rotate out here. And this actually breaks the Darce grip. The pressure of it is very, very strong. And then I don't stop here, I, I do like a little shrimp and I swing my legs and start sitting up to escape the position. Okay, let's do it again. This is another tricky movement. So here, I want to be trying to defend this before it happens, but if you do get locked in, I'm dropping to my right shoulder and I'm reaching behind my knee. And look, his, his grip is still tight, but when I open my leg and I roll to my back, that grip will break. And then from here, I'm just sitting up and trying to free the position. Can you guys hear me? So I'll show it without a partner. So you're getting darsed on this side. I want to drop to the shoulder of the dars lock. So the lock is here by my right, the right side of my neck. I drop to the shoulder like this, and then I'm reaching behind my leg. This creates the space. And then I have to like stay on my head, but bring my right knee underneath to like replace where my left foot is here. And I'm holding his weight with my leg and I have my arm strong and I roll through from here like this, and the weight of my body falling will open the Darce lock. And if it doesn't open it completely, you stay there and keep rocking until you can break that grip. And he has to either let go or readjust the position and he can escape. I started doing that back at Purple Belt and it's, it served me really well. It's like one of the only ways I know that you can actually escape a Darce lock, fully locked. <clears throat> Does the roll threaten him from finishing the darts from mount? No, because your right hand is at his knee and his hip, so he can't step over you. If you put your hand in the right place, he can't follow and step over because your hand is blocking at the knee. This leg's behind your leg, this leg is there. <clears throat> so I would suggest trying that one, guys. If you have your little training buddy or dog or get your dog to darts you, maybe you can try and escape. I'm not sure how you're gonna practice that one right now.